So we have another system of inequalities to solve. We're going to solve it by graphing. Um, and they're going to give it a little, you know, a little bit different just so we can practice some things. So we take the first um, inequality, write it as an equation, y equals 3x minus 2. Okay, slope is 3, or 3 over 1. Y-intercept is the point 0, negative 2. So here we are at 0, negative 2. I'm going to count up 3, 1, 2, 3, and over 1. I always like to put lots of points. I feel like it makes my line straighter. I can't draw a straight line. Okay, now solid or dotted? It's going to be solid this time. Hopefully you said that because it's got the equal to. It's, it's greater than or equal to. So solid line. Okay, so I see the, the origin there. Um, it's really close to the line, but I'm going to use it anyway because it's pretty convenient to use. You could pick another point that's way off from the line, and that would work too. Sometime I'm going to have to do that. Um, okay, so here's my inequality then. 0 is greater than or equal to 3 times 0 minus 2. 0 is greater than or equal to negative 2. Yeah, 0, negative 2. Okay, yes, that is true. The answer isn't always yes, but for some reason, they're giving us ones that have a yes. Okay, so this is true. All these points then over here with that origin that we just tried, the whole team wins. Okay, so if you're having trouble with the graphing, you can go back to, I don't remember which section it is, like 3.4 or something where we um, showed you how to graph these. Okay, now the second inequality. We'll think of it as an equation, y equals negative 1. That's, now, now you have to remember, that's a horizontal line. And it's going to be at negative 1. Will that line be solid or dotted? It will be dotted. Because it's just a less than this time. So negative 1, horizontal line. I don't know if you can see it. Hopefully you can see it. It's right there in at negative 1. That is a dotted horizontal line. Okay, now think about y is less than negative 1. So if you think about the point 0, 0, y, right there is the y, is 0 less than negative 1? No. No, so it's not going to be above the line. Here's the origin. Um, there's... There's the point zero, 0, It's not going to include that point, so it's got to be down here. It's got to be below the line this time. Okay? All right, now get out the highlighter. And what section is it? It's this section right, right in there. Okay, so that's how you do that one.